Could you please share us your story or experience about your use for the DVR and do, did you know why DVR come to the market? Yes, uh, so when, uh, when you park the car uh, outside, you know, mm -hmm. if, you, if your car without the DVR okay. recorder, mm -hmm. okay. if, 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 if some guys or some, some cars Crash, crash your car, and you will, you will, you will not, you don't know uh, what is happened. Mm. So you will be just angry, just angry. Uh, uh, you can do nothing. But if your car installed the uh, DVR, so you can record that side, and you will know what it happened. And also, so you you will have the evidence. So you can prove this evidence to the police, maybe, so you can know. Uh, how does this crash happen? So mm. maybe the police will uh, get that guy. Mm. So this this is the, the first reason why your cars need should to install the DVR. Mm -hmm. And uh, we know uh, the more and more, more and more cars, more and more, more and more family with the cars. So when you drive on the road, you will see more and more cars. And uh, every time when we Get off the worker and the, and the, uh, drive to home. You will you will have a bigger 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 traffic traffic jams traffic jams. Mm -hmm. So uh, the the car more and more and uh, you told me you you have see uh, almost every day you can see that, that an accident happen on the road yes. or some car crash. Uh, yes. yes, not only the cars and also we can show uh, many of the. Electric bike, electric bike. So they they also they often uh, drive it not uh, normally, maybe left right. So change the lane suddenly. Yeah, change the lane suddenly. Oh, left yeah. right. So it easily sometimes you will uh, ignore it and easily make a crash. Mm -hmm. So if you if your car uh, do not have the DVR, so it's hard to distinguish who is the responsibility. Mm. And if you can install the DVI, so you can record it. So uh, the police, when you call the police, uh, the police uh, play back the video, so he can know the responsibility clearly. Mm -hmm. So these two uh, story tell us the DVI is very important in our daily life. Mm -hmm. So if you have a car, have not installed the Give us, you can contact with us. Yes, you can choose the sedimented DVR. Mm -hmm. The sedimented DVR is with a high quality. And this DVR is not uh, just uh, a simple, use as a simple record, recording, but also can have the, uh, add, uh, many other functions. I will, we, we will show you the uh, one by one. Yeah. So, uh, in a word, the DVR is for the when uh, the accident happening, mm -hmm. uh, for the accident both for, uh, in front of your car or behind your car. Yes. The DVR uh, will recording the uh, accident. Yes. And then uh, you, uh, you will find uh, objectively uh, uh, what's the reason to cause a accident. Yes. And who should take the corresponding responsibility? Yes. No any argument. No yes, any argument. Yes. Okay. That's why the DVR come to the market and the reason. And for me, and for me, mm -hmm. I can also share that it's a DVR not not only to recording uh, if an uh, accident happening. Mm -hmm. For me, uh, when I drive on the road, mm -hmm. and sometimes I will see some beautiful scene yes. in front of my car. <laughs> yes. Really, it's really. It's really. Yes. Yeah. I will do some thing in, uh, in front of my car. Especially I, the beautiful girl. <laughs> girl? Uh, beautiful girl? No, no, girl. no, no, no. <laughs> no, it's for you, not for no, me. No, because no. if you only focus on the beautiful girl, yeah. you will distract your attention. Maybe you will cause the accident. Yes. And then you take the uh, the major responsibility. Yeah. So for me, I'm not just focusing the on the beautiful girl yes. on the uh, on the road when I'm driving. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, only the case when I'm stopping, there's a one girl passing by. I said, "Oh, I just have 
I just see it, oh that's okay because mm. I, I already stopped yes. but when I driving I just focus on the road so maybe you, the listen to some beautiful music so if you are without the DVI so if these things is hard to say put it together yeah uh, yeah if I want to recording some beautiful scene on my driving road mm -hmm. uh, I cannot take my uh, phone and playing the uh, and record the video yes. but my uh, my the DVI the high resolution high resolution still made DVI can do it yes of yes. course so, so now let's starting up for the uh, for the recording mm -hmm. uh, quality okay. is you see that is a uh, from camera here from camera from camera and also there's a rear camera rear camera okay from camera to recording the from view and the rear camera uh, recording the car behind yes and also for the mirror type the resolution for the uh, for the recording uh, lens is 108OP high resolution, rear, rear high resolution, 108OP. Also, the rear is also the 108 Yeah, yeah, both, yeah, two both. channel, two channel. So maybe you can, mm. Austin, can you show our audience uh, the front scene and the rear scene and both half and half? Yes, and also you can see the, the, video, the, the image is vivid, high resolution. It's very good. This is for front. Mm -hmm. Yes, you can watch my my hands. Your hand? Yeah. Your hand is clean. Oh, it's very clean. <laughs> yeah, high resolution. Yes, it's high resolution. This should be for real. For real? Yes. Okay, you can see our. Okay. Yeah, you can see our technician. No, technician director. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And both half and half. Yes. It's half and half. Half and half, two channel, and maybe you can turn off the turn off the image, turn off the screen, just like a yes. normal optical mirror. Yes. Just like an optical mirror, and when you turn off, you can use at the original. Yeah. Mirror. When you tip the screen, yes, it will pop up. Yes. And uh, 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 recover the image. Yes. 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 Even you turn on the green, the recording is is continued. Yes. So the continue story store the image to our uh, storage car. Yes. Yes, to our storage car. And uh, uh, why uh, when the image turn off, turn off, mm -hmm. and then this mirror because uh, it's a high quality mirror, is a is a high end uh, mirror uh, material, and the reflected rate is up to. 45 percent yes so it can make uh, just like a, a normal meter yes normal for meter. some product with a low reflective rate yes. you cannot use it uh, 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 well so the it's reflect a is not very good yeah 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 yeah, yeah. so uh, this is one of the uh, features high quality on steel made uh, DVR uh, meter, meter type yes, yes. And also, I want to share one special design. It's like this. Like this. You can talk it about this. Okay. Maybe I I let you know like this. Like this. It's here. You can see this is the slot for the cable port here inside it. So, uh, when the you see it, uh. Okay. When the cable is connected, you cannot see the cable port in front of you because they hide behind. So it make the cable link, the wiring is very elegant and just make your pro make your mirror look more like original. Yes. So no, you, you can see. It, uh, yeah, you can here. just see. You cannot see the port uh, on behind. Uh, 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 on uh, yeah, you cannot see on behind. Yeah. Yes, you can yes. see here. You can. It's not any yeah, cable. it's a it's a smart design. Yeah. It's a smart design. And also there's a rubber band, rubber band. to secure uh, to secure to the original optical meter, you see. Um, uh, and our and our rubber band is with high quality material. Yeah. So even you even you tie on the original meter with a long time sunlight exposure. It cannot get broken. Yes. Yeah. It's strong. It's it's still strong. 
so don't worry about it. So you can see the flex is very tight. Even even you are driving, you even you are in a drive crazy driving condition, mm. it can be also secured. It's secured. Yes. Okay. Okay. Let me see. There's any anything we miss. Mm. Okay, uh, Ossie, mm -hmm. uh, do you know uh, the size? How, yes, how big for the size? Uh, this uh, 10 inch. Uh, yes, this is a 9.35 uh, inch IPS. Uh, we screen. can also call it 10 inch. Yes, yes. 10 inch IPS, IPS screen. Yes. And if somebody want a big one, do we have? Yes, we have. Let me show the picture. Yes. Okay. Yes, we have the 12 inch IPS uh, screen. If you want uh, the wider screen, you can choose this one. Oh, now our maximum size is the uh, 12 inch. Yes. It's a um, uh, rack angle. Rack angle. Yes. Rack angle time. Yeah. Okay, and also we both have a tape, tape fix tie. Yes. And also we have the back kit tie. Yes. Just like this, like that one. Yeah, we open it. Open it. Because someone, um, because some user want to, uh, Remove the original meter and then uh, install an, a black kit model. You see, this one, this one is the same size. It's the same size of uh, uh, with this uh, uh, tape flex tie. And this, the, you you can see there is a, a socket here to you can install a special uh, black kit. Uh, because each car, each car model, each car model has a special, uh, uh, has a special back kit. So we can supply you. Uh, you just tell us your car model, and we can supply you the corresponding uh, installation back kit. Yes. Then you can just use it uh, for one wheeler, and then you can also recording from the front and also from rear. You see the. The, the lens, the camera can can is a universal uh, moving. You see, okay. You see, and also you can see this is a is a blue line, blue line here, blue line here. And when there is a, some uh, accident, uh, there is a, a built-in shock sensor. Then the camera light will turn red to give some warning. Yes. And also can discourage some theft because someone wants to steal your car or do something do some illegal activity so they also can uh, flexing with red, red light red right. yes. Yes. yes okay yes and also we have other type of uh, for the bracket uh, fixed uh, this, this is, is a 12 12, 12 black, inch yeah 12 okay. inch bracket time meter DVR yes yeah Okay, uh, still may still we are is more than uh, just as a accident recorder or a beautiful scene recorder. But what is more is when driving on the road yes. uh, to, secure, to secure your driving safety. So still may, you just see our video, still may have too many uh, uh, security car uh, car technology. Mm -hmm. So we have integrated uh, all safety and security function into the DVR function into the DVR display. Mm -hmm. So now let's go to see our one S system video. Okay? Also uh, Okay, let's go.
小心Uh, okay, coming back, uh, you just see the video for our 1x system in this uh, M900 model. Mm -hmm. So uh, you can see there's total 8 uh, function integrated to show the corresponding uh, warning signal and the sound by the DVR display. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, let's go on the car and start our engine and go on the road and we will explain you one by one for the safety module okay uh, first one I let our let Mr. N. Austin to bring you for the first uh, first uh, new function okay uh, when you uh, turn on the engine and drive the car so first you need to take your seat safety belt First, a seat belt. Seat belt. You yeah. need to fasten your seat belt. Yes. Before you before you drive it. Yes. Need so, to... I show you the seat belt first. This is the seat belt. This is the seat belt. This is the This is our the seat belt model. Let, let me check it the component. Can you as well? Okay, there's a two component. Yes, there's just two component. Okay, how it works? Uh, this is the seat sensor. It's put the under the seat under mm -hmm, the seat. Mm -hmm, yeah. Actually, we can add four and four and four set. Well, this uh, you mean there's a, come uh, can up to four seats? Yes, yes. Uh, three three rear and uh, one for the left driver. Yeah, you mean the front passenger? Yeah, front and passenger. three rear passenger. Okay. Yes, and and this is also the sensor to close our seat belt. Uh, seat belt buckle sensor. The yeah. buckle sensor. Yeah, buckle this is sensor. buckle sensor yeah. to. Uh, here's the need, need go, how to say that to clear the metal. So he will. Uh, there's a uh, 3M sticker. Yes. Uh, you can uh, clip it, you can stick it on your buckle, and then there's a magnetic a inside. Magnetic inside. Magnetic yeah. inside. When the buck seat belt buckle, the metal part, uh, insert inside, it will detect it, okay? And when you remove the buckle, it can also detect for different situations. Yes, we can see here, this icon can show it uh, on our display, on our, on our DVR. When, when you uh, take well the seat belt, the icon will turn gray. If you not take well the See the belt will turn red. The icon. Uh, pardon. If you uh take away your uh, uh, safety set belt, take uh, away, take 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 away, well. uh, click click away well your seat belt. Uh, you fasten the seat belt. Uh, fasten the seat belt. Yes. Yeah, fasten the seat belt. The icon will turn show, green. Uh, yeah, show yeah. the green. Yeah. And when you release the buckle, buckle it's turn red to yeah. remind you to. Uh, First, the city mm -hmm. belt. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, in also in China, such as uh, Shenzhen, the city uh, have a law 
Uh, All passenger on the car need to fasten the uh, seatbelt. Seat yes. Not only the front passenger but also the rear. Yes. So this uh, function is uh, very important uh, to uh, to remind uh, remind the driver to also uh, mm -hmm. ask the passenger to fasten the fasten well the seatbelt. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Can you show me how to operate the pairing? Pairing uh, operation, pairing. Yes. So uh, first we need to uh, enter into the setting mode. mode uh, yes. Yeah. And then select the call. You 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 just you just go. I I speak. Okay. To save the time. Uh, when you enter enter the setting mode, you select the corresponding seat yes. for the seat belt loading purpose. Okay. When you select, for example, you you, uh, you select the rear middle seat, and then you just yes. put the you just put uh, the battery inside, and then you will, this this sensor will transmit a signal to the DVR, and then DVR can recognize oh this is for the rear middle seat. Yes. Well, yes. We now we just need to enter this interface and mm. uh, choose the. Is, is the other okay, and we just forgot to tell our audience is, uh, the DVR need uh, the DVR need a uh, receiver. The receiver can receive all the signal from total A function uh, module. For example, this transmit the signal, and this signal will. Uh, transmit to the receiver and the receiver connect to the DVR to show the status, to show the signal, show the warning. It's the same situation for other security module and safety module. It's the same. You just need one receiver for the optional safety module function. Module function. If you don't need any other module function, you don't need this receiver. You just uh, get this for a uh, DVR only. Yeah, just okay. uh, use uh, the DVR. Okay, this is uh, for the uh, seatbelt reminder. Yes. Yeah, because for example, if your kid is a naughty boy, yes, when you sit on uh, behind and you just, uh, but there's nobody compare with him, and maybe he will leave the car and play around. Yes. Yeah, not sitting well, but there will be a potential dangerous happen during some accident occur and you just stop suddenly and if the boy, the naughty boy not have a seatbelt uh, to secure, secure him sitting well, that will yes. be uh, dangerous. Yes. Okay. Okay, let's move to next. Before you driving, and, uh, what thing we can also to do, uh, you already fasten the seatbelt and yes. let's move to the next part for the last module. Yes. Uh, maybe you can. Okay, I will take this piece of cheek, take this one first. Okay, the next uh, model mm -hmm. I want to introduce uh, the customer is the AQM, is air conditioner monitor. Air quality monitor. Yes. Air quality monitor. Yes. Uh, because nowadays uh, there's more and more and more cars on the road. And uh, mm -hmm. Now the PM 2.5 is the most common air pollutant uh, surrounding us yes. in the air. So the this module, this module can detect the PM 2.5 and the value and the in the air, and then if the value is hitting the warning warning uh, level, the. Uh, the the module will transmit the signal to the receiver and reflect the and show the and show the yeah, value ready. value here to your to the customer. Yes. And at this time, uh, you should open your window and even the rooftop uh, sunroof window to recycling the fresh air inside yes. to protect uh, your health. To protect your house because now people spend more and more time on the car, so the car air quality is still uh, is a uh, very important uh, to consider. Yes, very important thing to consider. So this is um, uh, our 
our air quality monitoring module. Okay, and also there's another value is your T T B O C. T B O C. T B O C is mean the to the is the chemical chemical pollution. Uh, what chemical? Chemical pollution. Of chemical pollution. Yes. Oh. Okay. Yes. Okay. Uh, you you have more ideas, so you show our to show our audience. Yes, this also uh, to check the TVOC, the mineral chemical pollution. Uh, that is you the, mean the chemical pollution? Maybe maybe pronunciation is the chemical pollution. Uh -huh. Okay. Yes, this is the bad bad uh, uh, gas. Bad gas. Yes, it's the bad gas. To, uh -huh. it, uh, it's bad for our body health. Mm -hmm. So when when you the air condition is not good, this icon we can see here. Here is PM two point five. This icon will turn red, so it remind you to uh, open the window or mm. um, to let the fresh air to come in. Mm. Mm. There is also a pawn for the insulation. Can you share this? There is a one major pawn. Oh. Uh, we need to pay attention for insulation. Uh, the, uh, this uh, this power need to connect with the AC power. Need to must uh, connect with the AC power. This mm -hmm. is very important. Uh, anything? Huh? No. Yeah. Wait. Oh, maybe you. Um, if you buy this one, I will, I will remind you that one important thing is. This one you need to place this uh, part in an open space, open space. Not, not a closed secure place for example you cannot put uh, uh, this part in your handlebars because in handlebars uh, for this part it will make some circulation there's a built-in fans inside and when the fans will absorb the air you absorb the air and it will, there is a sensor to detect the air quality by both uh, TVOC and PM2.5 2.5. So you need to make uh, uh, make the uh, installation surrounding is an open area, can make uh, air circulation. Not on, not just put on the handlebars with a cold space because your the people is not in the handlebars, mm -hmm. it's on the outside. So this need to place in an open place to place on uh, in the open place. This is one important thing. So to remind, to mm -hmm. remind you, this uh, one is a very important. Mm -hmm. okay? okay, not just not just for ACC. Mm -hmm. So when you yeah. buy one, you need to pay attention for this part. Mm -hmm. So the install uh, position is also important. Yes. Okay, now uh, before we driving. We already fastened the seatbelt, mm -hmm. and the air quality is also in a good condition. Yes. Okay, now let's drive. Oh, when driving, what's what's uh, what's uh, the what's the function to protect our in our driving in our driving? On driving, TPMS can real time monitor four wheels uh, pressure and the temperature. So, I think the Next function, TPMS is the very important function to the cars. <coughs> okay, speak to our audience. Yeah, okay, this is our TPM, TPMS model. There are four, four sensors inside the box for four wheels. We we can see we can see here the the box without the uh, deep, uh, display. So our uh, tire pressure date and uh, temperature date will uh, show on uh, our DVR. So we don't need the uh, TPS display. Mm -hmm. So uh, I we just show that. We have this the uh, Wi-Fi a uh, single connect connector receiver receiver yeah single receiver so 
uh, the receiver will, will uh, receive the TV maps sensors signal and uh, show the date on our TVR. We can see here the tire pressure date and also the tire tem uh, temperature. We can show the four real tire pressure and the temperature on this icon. If some if some tire is with lower lower tire pressure or high tire pressure will uh, remind you and the icon will turn turn red. We can we can let me try it. Yes, we can see here. Here's the red red warning. It's uh, with a high higher tire tire, tem uh, tire pressure for zero point. Okay, usually the DIY will come with the alarming sound. Yes. Maybe now the setting is turn off the alarming. So uh, it's just uh, made you the warning value on the display. And there's a question. Uh, how long is the life for the TVMS sensor? Uh, this is our the internal sensor. For our internal sensor, uh, the battery life is uh, our more than five years, it's mm -hmm. more than five years. So mm -hmm. that's it enough for you to use the TBMS. TBMM, uh, yes, I think five years is very impressive. Uh, it's a very impressive value because uh, we usually change our tire within five years. Yeah. So that means even you change your new tire, replace a new one, the sensor is still in use. Yes. And did you know how we can make the sensor life so long because I can share you uh, we just give Austin a rest mm -hmm. to drink some water okay. because thank, he thank already you. talked a lot okay now uh, it's my turn is uh, because we use we used uh, the max cell battery yeah. max cell battery is from Japan, Japan yes. with a high power capacity and also we have used the Chip solution is the Infineon solution. Infineon chip Germany? solution from Germany. Yes. Okay. And also, we have a sleeping mode for the uh, for the sensor to save the power. And when the when the when the car speed running up to twenty five to twenty five uh, kilometer per hour. Uh, the sensor, the sensor uh, will active and and it work to transmit the signal to the display. display. Yes, and when the car stop and parking, the sensor will sleep and will not consume any power inside. Yeah, so that's why we can make the sensor is so long because the battery, because our. Uh, the PCB chip solution and our technology to better managing the power use during the long or no lifetime yes. usage. Okay. Yes. Now you already becoming bad. You are drinking a lot of water and <coughs> you want to speak more. Okay. okay. Now it's your turn. Okay. Next. Next model. Uh, when you check uh, your four. Four tires with a good uh, temperature or temperature, so you have a uh, safety to drive drive it. And then when you drive on the road, maybe uh, you cover some uh, blind spot uh, area. Uh, can you explain what is the blind spot area? Yes, maybe this is my car. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Must <laughs> see the bands. Okay. Uh, just just uh, at the same Okay. Uh, maybe this is uh, other guy's car. The bad guy car. Uh, bad okay. guy car. And when I drive it uh, online, and then uh, when I want to turn the light like this, at at this at this uh, at this point at this position, uh, my right uh, mirror cannot see this. Uh, Area. So we call this is the blind spot uh, zone. Okay. Uh, and then 
Uh, this time, this guy drive, 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 drive is all night. So, I cannot uh, see, see the cars from the right uh, middle. So, if I, if, if I still drive it, maybe so, we will make a crash. Mm -hmm. So, this is the reason why we need to install a blind, blind smart detect detector. Uh, what's the size for the bias box tool? Size for the bias box tool? The size of uh, our BS, BSD, uh, BSD uh, this is my product, uh, detect uh, size is uh, wide is uh, 5 meter and uh, 3 meter, 3 meter and long is uh, 5 meter. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This is our product detect uh, area. Okay, okay, we thank you, Austin. Maybe I can make it more clearly. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. thank you. Thank you. Uh, this is our uh, BSD product. Okay, I uh, explain what is the price for you. Mm -hmm. The Bible sort is a uh, uh, behind the car, uh, the car with five meter less mm -hmm. and three meter wide oh, for each side. So each side with uh, four fifteen. Uh, Square meter, square meter, each side. So from left and the right, there's total thirty square, square meter, meter yeah, bicycle box zoom. Mm -hmm. That means if the car is in this bicycle box zoom, your mirror cannot see the car directly. Yes, because the car is in your bicycle box zoom. Okay, but if the car is a is a longer than five meter, or for example, is a uh, 10 meter, you can see it on the uh, mirror. mirror yes. And when the car coming up within uh, uh, approaching the bicycle box zoom, you cannot see it. So that is the bicycle box zoom for each vehicle. Okay? And even even I I don't make a lane change. I don't make a lane change. But with our BSD, there is a warning for you there's car coming. There is a car coming. Okay? So maybe you can show our uh, component. Yes. This is our the sensor, BSD sensor. It's very small. Yes. Do not need to draw hole, just uh, adhere the bumper mm -hmm. by uh, some stick. The inside bumper. The 3M stick. Yes, two sensors. And this is our the ECU. Uh, our ECU use the 29 gigahertz microwave reader. Uh, 79. Uh, 79, yes. And this is the cable for the sensors and the Actually, the 79 is not for ECU, it's for sensor. Oh. Sensor, uh, yeah. sensor technology, the transmission uh, solution. The radar band is, the radar bandwidth is uh, 79 gigahertz. Mm -hmm. Yes. yes. Okay, so how it works? How it works? When we install the sensor, uh, actually we install the position is the rear bumper, the corner. Like yeah, right here. we have a ruler to make you uh, yeah, like here. to make a position for the both size sensor. Okay? Yes, mm -hmm. we have a video uh, to how to install the PSD uh, radio. Yes. You, you can watch our the video from the internet or our uh, company website. When we install these two sensors, uh, when we drive on the road and the uh, bad guy's car is uh, approaching our car. Uh, actually, uh, maybe that's not a bad guy because you don't make a lane change, okay? It's not a bad guy. Okay. It's just because this car is. Uh, uh, Drive. Driving too too slow, yeah. and this one want to in pass fast, it in fast. Okay, and we have if if we have installed the BSD, so when the guy when the car is approach us, uh, our BSD will send the signal, will attack will attack this car is approaching us, and the display will show the first level reminder is is the Yellow, yellow reminder, the first level. And when you turn, turn, turn on your left, if you want to turn left, and uh, 
turn on, turn, turn, turn the left light. Uh, when you turn the the, you just turn the signal. Yes. The single light, single left, the left single light. Uh, left or right both is okay. When yes. you turn the signal, the turning signal, uh, when you turn signal, it means you want to make a link change. Yes. Okay. When you want to make a link change, there is a potential uh, X, uh, collision because you want to make a link change, but there is a card uh, in your blind spot zoom. Yes. So the warning signal will turn red yeah, yes, to we'll give you the yeah, warning. Yeah. Yes. And if the car is you don't make the link change, you don't turn on the turn signal. If the car is just enter approaching your uh, bicycle zone, it's just in yellow. Yes, just okay. In the first That's a different. That's yes. a different. Yes. And also, when you are quite familiar with our system, the signal you can just identify. You don't even uh, see the DVR. You just identify by the sound because yes. uh, left and right have different sound, and also the yellow and red is with different sound. So you can charge it by the different side of the ties from left or right. Yes. Okay. Of that's okay. That's very easy. Okay. Yes. Okay. That's uh, it for the our blind spot detect. Uh, I suggest you need to need to buy the whole set of our DVR. Then you can make quite familiar, quite familiar, and can do a better presentation. It's not, and now it's not too familiar. Mm -hmm. So you need to buy one. You can buy from me. Okay. I, I will cons yeah, I will, I will send you a PI. Maybe you give me the money and I just give you after this show. Okay. Fifty percent. Fifty percent. No. Uh, if you can make a very very good presentation, okay. I can give you for free. That's okay. okay. No problem. Okay. 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 So it's a bonus. Okay. It's very attractive. So you need to do it well. Okay. Okay. Okay, now let's move to the FCW. What is the FCW? FCW means forward collision warning. Forward collision warning. That means uh, there is a car, and then you just see the video. If the floor, the the same lane, the floor, the, in the same lane, the floor car suddenly stop, and the driver don't pay the focus on it and and just the driver is turning back to talk with his girl uh, with his wife and suddenly the car stops suddenly and there is a potential collision happening so the FCW module will give the, give the, uh, the warning yes there is a two, total two level one the uh, first level is, is yellow. Uh, yellow and the, and the second there. level is the red for the first level there is a potential at this time you just pay attention to control the speed to keep a uh, safety distance yes with the, 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 the distance car. too close uh, for uh, with the front car yes. and when there is a red signal you need to break immediately immediately to avoid the to avoid the uh, collision. Accident. Yes. So so so. Okay. Let us uh, check the component inside. This is our uh, ECU sensor. This is our sensors. It's very big. Yes, but in the future we have a small one like the packing sensor sensors. How to install this uh, sensor? Uh, this one actually we we have two uh, choice to install this uh, FCW. Mm. One is uh, uh, this install the your front of your bumper. One is the upper down da, uh, upper the down to the your front uh, license 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 plate. Yeah, license mm. plate. And the other is the of uh, uh, right and left uh, cr uh, bracket, bracket, bracket. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, yes, mm -hmm. there are two uh, choices to install the this sensor. Uh, how long is the detection distance? Uh, uh, detect detect the distance is uh, about uh, seventy meters. Okay, yes. it's long that's, enough. That's that is enough. Yeah. Uh, to you uh, take a break. Take a yes. Okay. Okay, now with TBMS on the road, just light, 
your your car with a nice and good sneaker on the foot. Yes. To make you can running fast, running long, running safety. Okay. And with BSW, you can make you safe. You can make you safe on the left and the, or and the right. And, and with the FCW, and make you same, same safer. Thing. Also, uh, we can talk is the safer when uh, when you drive in front uh, uh, forward. Okay. Yes. So uh, this is the three safety function when you're driving. Yes. Uh, TBMS, BSD, and FCW. Yes. Okay. Now, now we arrive to our destination and stop and start to enjoy, enjoy, enjoying our, enjoying our destination and activities. Maybe okay. Trip. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's your turn. Okay. When we reach our destination, maybe we'll go to uh, vacation or the or maybe to the holiday trips. So when you uh, need, first we need to park our cars, right? Talk to our audience. Yes, first we need to park our cars. So we need to uh, the parking as this assistance. When you when you do the parking. Uh, this is uh, this is our rear parking systems. That for the also it means that also it for the rear rear parking. Uh, actually, we installed it from our the rear bumper, and also we have the front 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 parking system, and this is installed. Uh, our front uh, bumpers. When you do the front front parking, maybe if you without the front uh, parking system, so you, it's hard to uh, know the distance from the front bumper to the obstacle. So you, so if you install the front parking system and uh, the rear parking system, that is very convenient to you, for you to do the parking. Let, let us check inside. This is our uh, parking assistant is ECU. ECU. It's also uh, wireless. It transmit the signal to the display. Uh, yes, it's also okay. yes. All the eight functions are uh, also uh, are transmit the signal to the our DVS by wireless. It's wireless. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, yeah. we we just need one receiver is yeah. okay. Yeah, one one receiver is okay. So uh, in that means you don't need to pay too much display on your dashboard. Yes. Also, this uh, actually, if you, when you buy our steamed uh packing system, you will know that actually generally our packing system um, come with the display, but uh, the this uh. Uh, one system without the display because we have that DVR as the big display to show all the uh, uh, single date on the on the screen. Uh, that means um, that means uh, traditionally, if you buy the independent product, for yes. example, you buy one TBMS product, there is a TBMS display. Yes. Uh, you usually put on the dashboard. Yes. And when you buy the independent parking system, yes. the system also come with a buzzer or display. Yes. And and in this case, you also place the display on your dashboard. Yes. 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 And there is some other product. So when you have more aftermarket uh, safety product, that means uh, that means you need to put different display on your yes. dashboard. Yes. Just like. Just like your dashboard is a showroom, showroom. Yes. But something I, I know, something we would like this scenario. Okay, but with one S system, we integrate it. We save all, all the, the display. Right. Yes. That means for one module, we save the display cost. We saving the cabling cost. Yes. Yes. So uh, so that's uh, the selling point and the feature for our uh, module. Uh, for the uh, of the one S component. Yes, of course. Uh, this is the sensor cable. It's the same uh, on the with the front uh, packaging system. The same. 
this is the this you just the issue is uh, bigger than this one. Actually, for the front uh, packing system, the cable need longer than the rear uh, packing system. Why? Because for the front uh, packing system assistance, we need to cross the engine. But you can, you can show it by this uh, car model. Yeah. Actually, we know our front packing system install the sensors uh, on the front of the bumper so our cable needs to from here to cross our engine room mm -hmm. so the cable need to longer than the rear rear packing sensor okay Okay, that's for the packing sensor. Yes, sir. Oh, th this one for the packing sensor. When we packing well, so we need to. Uh, when we lift the car, uh, yes, is there something to protect the car from being uh, stolen or from being impact? Yes. So we need to uh, align system. Align system. So this is our the last the, the last model is for the mm. packing. This is the uh, packing line system. Mm. How how it works? How it works? How it works? Oh. yes. Here is the siren. Uh, this is only a siren, but the uh, the distance is installed in the siren. When when some 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 guys. Uh, Touch your cask, and the cell, the G sensor will uh, send the signals, and the car will uh, be, be maybe another voice to uh, alarm, alarm, alarm it. And uh, and also we can the the screen will also have a remind to. To the DVR, the DVR also can record record this uh, this site, this uh, this uh, video. Can take a video for this. Um, actually, there is some impact. Yes. And some mm. illegal uh, activity on the card. Yes. Uh, the siren with the built-in bus, uh, uh built-in G sensor, shock yes. sensor, and when there is an impact or any illegal, it will. Uh, trigger the the siren to give you a big sound alarm. Beep, 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 beep. Yes, the, the DVR this, will record. For the sound, the sound will discourage the illegal activity from theft. And also, uh, this this uh, module will transmit the signal and to activate the DVR to uh, emergency recording for both front and the rear of the car. So give, give the car uh, all surrounding uh, protect, protection, okay? Yes. That's for the, uh, for the, the parking alarm model, okay? Yes. So that's total to, uh, eight, eight functions. functions. Uh, for one function is the DVR recording. The second function is the air quality monitoring. Yes. And the third is the seatbelt reminder. Yes. And the four is the TBMS, five is the BSD, six is the FCW mm -hmm. for work collision warning, and the seven is the parking, and the eight, the last one is the parking and alarm system. system. Yes. It's a total A function. They just uh, integrated on one display, uh, on one display screen. Uh, okay, now our time is almost ending and uh, KC team is uh, ready to show you another yes. new product. Yes. Uh, okay, by the end, uh, there's uh, the, la the last is the small machine time. Yes. Okay, it's the same function, same function. Uh, same function compared with this middle type, uh, but uh, with a uh, uh, three inch pink uh, screen. Yes. Screen. And also there is a Wi-Fi 
uh, Wi-Fi connection with your cell phone so you can uh, see the recording video by your cell phone, phone yes. by the Wi-Fi connection yes. by Wi-Fi connection and also there's uh, some special function for the small machine type is uh, there is a uh, uh, traffic light signal reminder yes. the speed side limit remind and also the start up with uh, remind uh, there is a uh, if your car is stopped and and there's a traffic light and the from if when the light turn green and you forgot you forget to go and the uh, the traffic light reminder and the start up reminder will give you the human reminder. voice you should start to move forward your car yes yes that's uh, some special function okay at the last we see the video for this uh D600 model uh, also integrated with total uh, A optional functions. functions.